Hello everybody, this is Corbin from Zoco Marketing and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to install the Facebook Pixel through Google Tag Manager. So the first thing you're going to want to do is come into um, your, your business manager in Facebook. You're going to come here to data sources and then you're going to go to this little button right here that says add event and we are going to go from a new website. So click in here and for this case we're going to be installing through Google Tag Manager so it's going to be manually. We're going to copy this code and then hit continue. Um, we're going to leave these just as the default that they are. Continue. And uh, from here, we're actually just going to exit out and head over to Google Tag Manager. So now that we have the code uh, copied, we are going to go into uh, to create a new tag in Google Tag Manager. So we're going to go tags, click on new. We're going to call this Facebook Pixel. Now, Facebook doesn't have a direct integration with Google Tag Manager, so in this case, we're going to use custom HTML right here. Now, just simply paste in your Facebook Pixel code. And now that we have the tag configured, we need to define the trigger, the action that will tell uh, Google Tag Manager when to fire this event. And for the Facebook pixel, you want this firing on all pages of your website. So we're gonna click on all pages, hit save. And that is it, you have now created your Facebook pixel inside of Google Tag Manager. Also, don't forget to publish this tag inside of Google Tag Manager before going to the next step. Now, if you want to verify that your pixel is firing on your page, the easiest way to do this is to go to the Chrome store um, search for Facebook Pixel Helper, and you will see this little um, handy Chrome extension. Uh, now, I already have this installed up here in the top right-hand corner, but for you, if you don't have this already, go ahead and give that an install. And then from there, go to the web page that you just installed the tag on and uh, test, and I'll show you how to do that next. So here we are on the web page, and right from the beginning when the page loads, uh, you can see these two little green uh, notifications. This is showing us that our page view did in fact fire. So the tag is set up correctly. We got the little green check mark. Um, there are a couple of different statuses. There's a yellow, which means there might be a slight problem that you need to check into. And there is a red, which means there's a critical error and your pixel is not firing. Typically, when you uh, do have those kind of errors, you can click down in these and it will show you um, what that error might be and how you can fix it. So there you have it. You now have successfully installed uh, face the Facebook pixel onto your website through Google Tag Manager. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want some more uh, quick marketing tips and tricks.